Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. Today we are live swatching Lumen Nails Daydream Collection. This collection will be dropping on March 11th and I will have the sales info down below just in case you forgot. As always, if you enjoy live swatches, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you never miss an upload. And we are starting off with Saturata. This one is described as a linear holographic polish infused with pink to orange to turquoise shimmer that captures light at every angle, inspired by the wings of the dragonfly, both strong and delicate and shimmering with a quiet beauty that is awe-inspiring. Of course, I am trying to feature that hollow because it practically took my breath away. It's so pretty and delicate and subtle, but when you catch it, it is a special treat. So I wholly enjoy this one. And in case I forget to mention it, there's really no polishes in this collection that are hard to apply. The formulas are smooth and good to work with. Next up is Candy Clouds. This one is actually asking the question, is there anything more dreamy than a sky filled with pink and blue clouds that turn purple where they meet at the sunset? Shantae actually loves this time of day and gazing into the sky during this magical moment when it's a candy colored fluffy clouds dream. So now that you have the inspiration, you can totally tell where it came from. <laughs> and we have a serene breeze, which is inspired by warm, gentle breezes where wishes float off to be granted and butterflies glide from flower to flower. This gray blue base with a playful color shift flake is saturated with purple, pink, amber, and magenta shimmer. So that accounts for the unique coloring of this polish. And of course, whenever it has that like sunset vibe, I really go all in. I love it so much. But what I really enjoyed is like that touch of hollow there. I keep asking myself, is there hollow there? Am I imagining it? Let me know down below in the comments if you see it too, or if I'm just reaching at this point. But last for this set of polishes is Diamond Skies. This one is described as a lavender base with, loaded with reflective glitter and saturated with a pink to orange and teal shimmer. So I'm still not over reflective glitters. I still love that starshine sparkle. And I did want to say, well... The glitters in these are a little harder to remove if you're like me and you enjoy that star shine, that glitz, that absolutely undeniable, irresistible sparkle. It is totally worth it. Just use your clips when you're removing and a smoothing top coat for when you are topping it off. So smoothing top coat and then regular glossy top coat because I prefer glossy. And then here's the side by side. I'm still seeing, I'm still seeing some hollow and serene breeze. Definitely let me know if you guys see it too. And we are going to move on to our next set. This one is Shimmering Surf, a cool toned blue with a purple pink and green shimmer that captures the sparkle of deep blue ocean waters. There could not have been a better description for a polish than that because I am definitely seeing that uh, I'm seeing that vision in this polish because I see that green come out really strong and then the purple just at the edges barely like almost a lavender. It's not super strong and prevalent. 
And I'm sure the pink is somewhere in there, but I never claim anything that I'm not seeing in the polishes myself. So that brings us to Sun Glow. This one is a vibrant sunny yellow with warm toned shimmer and flakies that will have you feel like you're walking on sunshine. So as soon as I opened this set of PR polishes, Sun Glow stood out immediately to me. I don't know if it's because I am so done with winter at this point, or if it is just the nice combination of flakies and a warm toned yellow. Cool toned yellows do not work with me. They don't like me. So anytime I see a warm toned yellow, I'm already on board. The flakies here were just a bonus and I thought it was just really pretty. Next up is Sunburst. So <laughs> I'm pausing because I felt like there were more polishes in this collection, but we're actually on the second to last one. So if you're enjoying this video, go ahead and leave a like down below. Let me know if you're getting any of these or if you have something similar in your collection, I want to hear about them. But Sunburst is a warm and sunny, vibrant coral with radiating pink shimmer that shifts golden to red at extreme angles. Totally true. I fell in love with this polish as soon as I put it on because there is a lot more orange in it than what's picking up on my camera but I still just I love it anyway because it does lean very red in my eyes and last we have Moonlit Meadow which is a deep plum with a red to amber shift now this one I was really excited to describe to you guys and talk about it because in one of the previous collections and I don't know why I can't remember the name of the collection. There was Sunset and Horizon. Two polishes I thought were absolutely gorgeous. And I decided to use one as a base, the other as a topper. And it came out to something similar to this. So I'm really hyped to see Ben Shante from... Lumen Nails went ahead and made one like it. It's the red shimmer. It's that red glow for me. I'm already obsessed with reds and I've been a purple fan forever. So that one was right up my alley. So I don't know if you can all tell or not, but the second set I think is my favorite because I am ready for these brights and ready for these vibrants. But the first set gives you that nice warm up like spring colors to move you into the season. But that is it for me today. I'm going to wrap this video up here. And if you're part of my nail fam, thank you so much for your time, for your energy, for your good vibes and your support. I really appreciate it. Sending out virtual hugs. If you are not, I hope you'll consider subscribing and hanging out with us. As always, take care of yourselves and each other.